like here's a generic he wants it to be like the best of the best yeah. right and so whatever do you think like quentin we will do do that because we've already kind of done something with antoine yeah. so it might be good to do it with quentin yeah and then um i put like a couple of creative like, things like, I think, if he's going to be doing it in Vancouver, and he's like 16 weeks out now, so yeah. just keep in mind like eight weeks out, so in another two months. We'll be going hard. It'll be heavier content. Yeah. Him. And then Quentin would be like, I think Quentin would be like probably eight weeks behind him. So like, you know what I mean? Then after eight months done, it'll be Quentin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, here the Where's she coming from? Oh, she's from Burlington. Uh, so Put a filter on it. We're, we're doing like um like a day in the life like uh behind the scenes of like the company and stuff like that. So. Oh my gosh, yeah, that's yeah, so yeah. cool! Yeah. <laughs> All right, yeah, yeah. I'm like kind of masked, yeah, not yeah, masked. Yeah. How no, are you? Good, good. All right, good. Uh, I can Amazing. Show, I can show you around. Too, okay, cool. Want. Yeah, yeah, I love it. Little, yeah, let's do a little tour. Yeah, let's do a little tour. Yeah. 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 So like, and I don't know if this is stuff that you're into or not. I'm not sure. Yeah. But almost like this, this, uh, this cage stuff here. Yes. It was a cage wall with like, yeah. you know, fixtures that were coming out, like shelving and like yeah, exactly. Something to sort of like enclose it, but still be open concept. Totally. Yeah. So we're like, we're at something. It's just makeshift right now, but that's what we want to do. Yeah. And that's later. what you need. I'm totally on board with that look. Yeah. Or it's like, have you seen? You can probably find it on Pinterest and stuff. It's like images of. It's almost like. Um, I, it's like pipe work almost yeah, exactly. that you just it. like yeah, yeah. mount industrial almost like this, almost like this pipe right here right exactly yeah, but yeah. it's like fixed yeah, to the I wall like or too. fixed to the ground yeah, i like that stuff too and just make it so yeah. it's open and like a couple spots to yeah. leave in and out yeah exactly but you can see it from both sides exactly so it's open it's open but cool. also enclosed somehow you yeah know? yeah so yeah anyways nice so i'll show you around a little bit yes this was actually like we took this over yeah, but where, where were you guys located before? This is the uh, behind the scenes vlog. What Can I interest doing? you in some uh, fitness equipment? Wow. This beautiful used Atlantis hack squat. We can get brand new equipment for you too, Prime right here, you know. So are you guys moving stuff into the gym? Yeah, we just got a delivery of Prime equipment. Can you go show me what, yeah, absolutely. what you guys are doing? Yeah. Balance first day. I'm nervous. It's your first day. <laughs> He's doing a great job. It's a brand new load of prime equipment. It's actually going to the UK to Nathan Dasha's gym. Yep. Yeah, because we uh, we ordered it all from the manufacturer, and because we got some equipment for ourselves, and we'll be sending all of his equipment uh, to him wow. in the UK, shipping it all I think, next week. So then it's just going to eat up all our warehouse space. Perfect. <laughs> this is how it comes. Beautifully covered and protected. All the scuffs on them were already there. We didn't do that. <laughs> how many times a month do you think like you get equipment from Atlantis Prime? Uh, well, it depends on how much we're ordering it. Right now, we just got two uh, truckloads of Atlantis stuff in to replace uh, a bunch of the uh, equipment that's in the gym. Uh, we got a few Prime pieces here. Um, one's to replace the current piece and the other two are new ones. Nice. Um, we got a nice new functional trainer with articulating arms, which is going to be awesome. Something that we didn't really have in the gym so far. Um, and then there's a couple other pieces. I don't know if these two on the under ours as well, but uh, yeah, depending on how often or how much we're selling, yeah. uh, that depends. And then I don't think you introduced yourself. I'm Mark. Yeah. I'm the senior sales representative for Pure Muscle Athletics. Nice. Nice. <laughs> man. Yeah. This is Dave. <laughs> Hi, Dave. I do a bunch of stuff. Dave's a do-all, get stuff done guy. He's also a firefighter and newly single. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> get a bicep flex in there. <laughs> Trainer, leg extensions, what, what else is the other two pieces in the warehouse? Did you personally pick these stuff? Yeah, we just got another order in from uh, 
from Prime. So I think we got like six pieces, um, but there's a lot more in there because Nathan Diasha, we ordered a bunch for him as well. And his stuff is custom colored for his gym with a black and blue. So that's, we're gonna be shipping that out to London for him. So he got, I think he got a little more than us. I think he maybe got like 10 or 12 pieces. Looks pretty nice though. One of the pieces I got is Evo and not hybrid. So they have two different lines, right? Mm -hmm. Let me check the cam. Cam. Evo, Evo like the Cam. Looks like cam's different, right? Okay. They're supposed to be smaller, I think. The Evo mm -hmm. platform itself yeah, it is, it's it's much smaller, smaller than yeah. the hybrid. The hybrid's bulkier. And it's a new cam. Look at this. Yeah. Shoulder press is a big one. You can find space for that. Wow. Okay, so we got the shoulder press. And then we also got the isolateral select rise okay. pull down. That's cool. That piece looks good. Check out the old school Nautilus lateral raise. If you remember in uh, the gym that Ronnie Coleman was training at when he won all the Olympias, he was using that one. Copy my style, five shots couldn't drop me. I took it in smell. Yeah. We actually have like the complete circuit for that around the other side. What year do you think that's from? Like 80s? Late 80s. Late 80s. It's actually in really good shape too. Yeah. So here's all Nathan stuff. Here's all the black with the blue. Look at this refurbished. Yeah, man. He did a pretty good job on the painting. Oh, wow. That's right? the guy there in Burlington. Yeah. He did a pretty good job. Oh, wow. It looks great. I'm not happy with that. Yeah, so this stuff here is just a couple more pieces. Um, here's a lying hamster barrel. Nautilus. And this one's actually really awesome. This is a pullover on chains, That's double massive. double chains. So, and it's all in really good shape, like the cherry red. Is, so I think we're gonna leave it original. Is this going anywhere? I think uh, a couple of the pieces we're gonna keep yeah. and the rest will list. Yeah. Definitely gonna keep the pullover. Where can people find like the listings? We put it all on Pure Muscle Athletics, right? Yeah. yeah. And if you're looking for anything, like all this equipment is technically for sale. So if you guys are looking for anything, um, you can reach out to us and we can help you out. Is that a Nautilus press up there? Yes. I never saw that. No, you did. You said you make capable C. Really? Press? Yeah. Just yeah. press? Yes. I never <laughs> saw that. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, that's a good piece. Oh, it is. It is amazing shape. The Nitro chest press. Yeah. We sold the, the Cedar Rose, right? Yeah, it's gone. Yeah. A couple of gems back here. I actually love this Cybex. It has to them now, so yeah. Yeah. So yeah, another one over there. That one's even older. It's got the old uh, metal flax. Yeah. That over there with the maroon padding is old flex leverage leg extension. I can't wait to try this one. It looks really great. Mm -hmm. Got the swivel handles on it. Yep. We got car seats too. If anyone's looking for baby, baby car seats, we got good inventory on those. <laughs> I don't know. Is it, no? no, no, no. It's no, not mine. No, I, I know you would think me. I thought it was yours. We probably will ship it even first with the brand this because this you can use it right away, right? I think it's existing gym. Yeah. Because where Atlantis, I think, goes for the new one. Yes. We have a lot of equipment coming in a couple weeks. I think in four weeks we have a Panada order coming as well, which is like probably thirty plus pieces. So we're gonna have to get rid of some of the least popular items and make more space. How do you choose that? Like, how do you how do you pick? Um, yeah, it's tough, right? <laughs> it's tough. <laughs> it's tough, but I know just from experience. And which pieces are hot? And which pieces are not getting used as much? Because sometimes you take a risk on pieces, right? You order something from new manufacturers, and maybe you didn't get the opportunity to try everything. So if you order ten pieces, maybe only seven of them are a, are a hit. Three of them are a little off, so you get rid of them. Um, but we're trying to create more space too. Right now we're speaking to the landlord. We might actually be making this back here a part of the gym and moving our warehouse to another unit that's available right beside here. Like literally the unit next door to the pure OG side, the black side. So then back here, we might make this more like functional training, power lifting, you know, a lot more racks, deadlift platforms move the turf in there, which is going to allow and create a lot more space for more, you know, pieces of equipment for us. So if we do utilize this back here for the gym, we have to get the landlord, because this was like an old mill originally, and if you look at this, you might not be able to tell the lights, 
but it literally goes up. It's like these these ceilings in here are 25 feet, and it goes up like another 25 feet. This used to be like, if you look up there, there's hand railings and stuff throughout, and there's stairs. Those that's actually, actually an old staircase that was just taken down. Shit. So this was like, you know, like I think in some of the Terminator movies when they're like going yeah. up through the factory. It was like that, like stairs throughout different levels. She so, could easily put like a, two floors in here. Yeah, I don't know, like just legalities though, right? Wow. So, but I've like looked up there and I've seen like, there's like a couple uh, like phones on the walls up there and stuff. But what, what I think we're gonna have propose to the landlord is if you could actually cover this, drop down all the sprinkler heads, um, and then basically cover it with a ceiling, like the same metal that's throughout with the ceiling. That way we can just paint it all black and then uh, instead it's going to look nice and we can utilize this back here for the gym. Because right now it just looks ugly. What happens is because the heating, the HVAC is right there, heat rises. So in the winter time, everything just gets sucked up and it's like a lot colder back here. Yeah, yeah. yeah this one doesn't really need yeah. a mirror. Yeah. Even this. Yeah, I prefer that one in the mirror versus this one. Okay. Because I use that one. <laughs> how are you doing? Uh, I mean, right now, I'm moving. You're not moving just... equipment, I hope. No, no, no. <laughs> you pull the hydro oh, position, you like move this here, put that over there. One yeah. of those things where it's like every day it's like a surprise. Like one day it's a 8 out of 10, one day it's a 6 out of 10. It's... Where's it been today? Uh, this morning I woke up and I'd say it's about a 7 and a half this morning. And then by the time I like moved around, got here, it's probably about 4 and a half now. Okay. So it's like it feels a little better. Okay. So it's always like the night time, it kind of starts to get a little bit worse. During the night, it's worse, and then I wake up and it's like... What's your job and your name? My name is Emerson, and I work for HD Muscle. Nice. I run the warehouse in the back, wow. which is where we are right now. But no, I got I to gotta count everything today. Every, um, every Tuesday, Friday, I got to do inventory, count everything, make sure everything's updated online. So I'm going to do that right now just so we don't run into any problems and everything's good to go. Can you give us any, like... Any secret insider info of like, like anything that's com coming? Um, we just received some clothing now, actually right there. Um, I'm not too sure what it is yet. Jordan just picked it know. up. I don't even know. Surprise Whoa. bin. That's secret secret. That is secret secret. I think Mariah's opening it up. I think she is. <laughs> yeah. Um, yo. Behind what scenes? Behind this. This scene? Whatever we're doing, yeah. Oh, this is the best scene ever. What are you about? I'm about to, but these are 100 kilos. Ah, yeah. Right? Yeah, that's right. Yeah, it's kilos in the Pure Muscle Fitness. Easy so. peasy. Easy peasy. I also saw that you brought your baby in the other yeah. day, and you let Quentin hold the baby. Yeah, he fed him a little bit of AC, pro AC. Awesome. We're trying to get him started young, and I told Dorian too, like nothing compound yet, isolation movements. Perfect. He's working on posing today. Nice. He's in the posing room, I'll so talk that. yeah, he's, we're looking for like junior, junior, junior bodybuilding. Junior, junior, gotcha. Yeah. Do you think he's going, going to be classic physique, bodybuilding? Oh, he'll be open. He'll be open, yeah. For okay. sure, way bigger than me. Okay. I already told him, like everyone, he's got to set the bar a lot higher than me, so he's got to go right to the top. We got new hoodies. Uh -huh. Yeah, do you like light gray? Yeah, okay, I'll get you one after. What's up? Hey, what's up? <laughs> we have a member here. Hello. You've been like a like a member of Pure for since the very beginning. Since the beginning. Um, how do you feel like when you see all of the new pieces coming in? Like a kid in the candy store. It's pretty cool. Eh? Yeah. Can't do wait you, to try them all. What's your favorite um, uh, piece company like Panada, Atlantis? Do you care? Anything? I really like the Prime stuff. The Prime stuff. Eh? Yeah. yeah. That's That's awesome. Awesome. That's cool. Thanks. Uh, Thanks, that. Laura. <laughs> Hi, my name is Thomas. I'm the assistant manager here at Pure Muscle and Fitness, and um, I'm here to show you what I do behind the desk. Nice. I hear you guys have coffee. Yes, we have this very fancy uh, Jura coffee machine. Um, we can do espresso, cappuccino, um, flat white, latte macchiato, lots of different uh, options here at Pure. Um, we also have this shake bar right behind you here. Very fancy. 
We have our four different flavors of protein you can choose from. Which one is the most popular? Most popular, I would have to say chocolate peanut butter is probably the best, in my opinion. Might be a little biased. All right, all right. Um, and then we have any sort of uh, supplement add-ons here. We have the carb, the creatine, the pre, um, any anything you want. Um, and then we have the rain fridge here, lots of different flavors. We just got this new flavor in, the white gummy bear. We're actually doing a uh, giveaway on the Instagram right now. Um, and if you buy one here in club, you get uh, an extra ballot for the giveaway. Um, we also have prep shop meals here. We have jerk chicken, pulled chicken, turkey burrito bowls, uh, flank steak meals, and some protein packs here on the bottom. Um, some more Daryl bars, uh, pure muscle fitness water. And then uh, over here is our pro shop. So we have supplements, protein bars, um, a lot of uh, different ranging supplements like ATP Lab, uh, Relight, um, our own brand, uh, HD, Kai Kai Cookies. We just got in Pride Foods, uh, Rice and Grinds, lots of different flavors there. Um, I think, yeah, we got a lot of merch here. We got some gas, better bodies. Um, we have our own HD line here as well and Pure Muscle. That's awesome, wow. Can, uh, can I have a coffee? Of course. And th that's for like any of the members? Yeah, you can come in at any time uh, during our staffed hours um, and ask for a coffee, just like that. How is it working at uh, Pure? Oh, I love it. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't feel like work. It's this awesome. place, this place is amazing. It's a playground for uh, anybody who loves fitness. And uh, yeah, great community. Um, there's there's really no place like it. It's hard once you, once you come here, it's hard to leave. That's true. Yeah. Oh no, you're. Found you. Oh wait. Yeah, I know oh, them oh. to myself. Yeah, for sure. Uh, Those are crops. Yeah, these are crops, but the like girls that. don't like them because like they're yeah. not just fitted here. And yeah. then this is on the back. It's a little bit different. It has like bigger yeah, like. Stay gold. Yeah. And ready. It would be cool in that. That same design it would be like a short sleeve hoodie. Like yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like kind of like a boxer style. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I agree. Yeah. yeah, they don't make them, but. Yeah. So then I have for spring, so it's a couple of new colors oh. chocolate brown, concrete oh, like long sleeve, pink. This is going to be puff print. That's puff print. Yeah, Stay yeah. gold. That's and then cool. uh, just got like a plain black one as well because everyone yeah. loves black. That's awesome. This will be coming. And then we have like blue. Also for spring, like, so yellow, pink. Yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, please get B-roll of that later. Someone yeah, napping. I want to have myself sleep on that. Napping? We have to get it. Whose bed video. is this? All right, guys, I'm not sure how the rest of the day is going to go as far as the vlog goes. Um, but basically here, every Friday, we get together as a team. We basically discuss everything going on with HT Muscle, um, you know, what we need to focus on for the weeks to come. Um, yeah, so we meet here at 10 o'clock. We go over everything as a team. Um, usually wrap things up by three o'clock and then uh, pretty much every Friday for me at least I usually see Eric Seaford usually do some training at three o'clock um, Noah's on a different schedule than I am Mariah is usually here pretty much all day Rachel is working out at three so we're usually all here together as a team Fridays um, so yeah if I don't see you guys that's sort of what goes down here at the HD Muscle headquarters I think Noah's got something to say. Put him over, there. Put him over there. Until next time. Yeah, if you guys like this kind of content, and you guys want to see more behind the scenes, what's going on here at the HD Muscle headquarters, Pure Muscle. Behind the brand. Yeah, behind the brand. Um, just comment down below. Let us know if you guys like this. If you guys want to see more of it, because we're more than happy to share it with you guys. Until next time.